The last one is moving in now. There's well in two, and they're all in line. They're off in the hilltop, but a good start for the local runner, Lil Spinner, who bounds out of the gate quickly. And Shirley's got speed, and from the outside, there goes after eight and well in two, and these two will duke it out early on. Miss New York came out running in fifth, up and down sixth. Breath Away is in the middle of the pack here. She's got a few horses beaten early on. She's about seven lengths off the lead. A spray is two and a half lengths behind her. Then the pair of Ice Cube Baby, and to the outside, Hang the Moon as they head to the backstretch. 30,000 Kelvin is the trailer through a 22.7 opening quarter mile. On to the back stretch after eight, the leader. On top a length and a half, well into his second. Lil Spinner third to the inside by another two and a half, and Shirley tracks in fourth. She's five lengths from the front right now. Side by side are up and down, and Miss New York just in behind them as they continue up the back stretch. Then breath away to the inside of a spray about eight lengths behind. Two and a half more back to Hank the Moon, who races outside of horses moving into the far turn. And Breath Away was in a little bit of traffic there as they round the turn. The half mile was 46 seconds, and it is after eight who's been there all the way so far and well in two, continues to press the pace in second. They have three on and Shirley in third. Miss New York is fourth. Breath Away still with work to do, and they're into the stretch with after eight to catch into the final furlong. And here's well into it. Breath Away is closing and closing stoutly now. And so is a spray on the outside. These two. Breath Away under a full head of steam. Runs by Breath Away and a spray and Bobby and Brad do it. Breath Away was second. Hang the Moon got third. Up and down was fourth and a final time of 134 flat. A spray undefeated in two career starts. Make it three for three, Jerry. Yeah, it was kind of hard to know how good she really was. Her numbers weren't all that fast, but both she and Breath Away got a wicked pace to run into. They were flying up front, but uh, Breath Away had a little traffic around the turn, got to save more ground than a spray, but both fillies are quality. Yeah, I mean, Breath Away did have an excuse of sorts because she did have to maneuver through traffic, but right about here, She's at least on even terms with the spray and maybe even in front of her, but a spray finishes faster. I mean, she had a better closing kick on this day than Breathaway did, which kind of surprised me because it looked to me mid-stretch like Breathaway was just going to blow through the field like she did in her last start. And Chad Brown with another very good three-year-old turf filly. Go figure. And she is bred to be an exceptionally good filly. The owner, Jan Nafee, and her late husband, Robert, bought the mare, the dam of a spray, from Coolmore and Aiden O'Brien, a filly named Up, for $2.2 million eight years ago. So this filly is really bred to be top-notch, and she's showing it right now on the track. Yeah, Chad Brown won this race once before 2019 with dog tag. Wins it again here in 2023. Went off at odds of 4-1. to one. Favorite breath away at nine to five.